Hey guys, um, I got something pretty cool today. It took a couple of weeks, but I finally got it. I got my little dream catcher frame, courtesy of uh, Benedict from uh, Micromotor Warehouse. And this is how I set it up. Um, basically stock uh, internals from Hobson. I took the parts from the Aqua, the Surf Edition Hobson, in, and I put it into this. LEDs front and back. Uh, and uh, these are the bottoms of uh, earplugs, which I'm hoping will do a pretty decent job absorbing impact from the bottom um, and I'm here at the field to uh, test fly it and uh, see how it performs It certainly has no problem uh, with lift. And it's really, really easy to see It's really easy to see the red frame. I know that uh, with the black frame, I definitely would have lost visibility. So yeah, I, I like uh, I like both the frame and I like my earplugs. It's up, up, up. It's a pretty cool frame. I like it. That's my overall impression. Um, I noticed that uh, if I do land, the motors do pop out very easily. And I may remedy that with a little bit of glue or uh, maybe Velcro. I'm not sure yet. And I might also use Velcro to secure the battery. Right now I'm using a rubber band and that's a bit and that's a bit painful to uh, work with. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm happy with it. Uh, I promised to crash it quite a bit, <laughs> so uh, we'll see how well it crashes. Okay, so overall I like it. Uh, I give it a very solid and respectable three thumbs up. And uh, good job on this, Benedict. I toast my uh, Red Bull to you. And uh, I'm looking forward to see what you will come up with uh, next.